Hey everyone, it's Laura, also known as Laura the Bargain Hunter. Wanted to do a video today showing you some friend mail that I got and also a kind of a small haul that I got from a couple of thrift stores, um, St. Vincent de Paul Thrift Store and Goodwill. Um, so first is friend mail. And there's a little bit of a story behind it. For those of you that know who Nancy Rounds is, you probably saw the story play out um, on her video chat and on one of her giveaways. So what happened was, um, I'd been following her for a little while. Uh, my friend Kim from Kimmy's Boxes does uh, shout out Sundays. And so I started adding a lot of people on and started watching their videos and kind of getting addicted to it, which is what made me want to start doing this. And I was in one of Nancy's giveaways um, and my name came up when she did the, you know, the spinner through YouTube. And unfortunately, I wasn't publicly subscribed, but I didn't know that that was a thing. I literally am so new at this. I've been watching YouTube videos for years, even before I started following like the unboxing videos. Um, but I didn't realize that, that that was something in your settings. So I didn't win. You know, she had to redraw the name, which that's part of the rules and that's fine. But I commented and I'm like, what, what happened? Why didn't I win? Because I literally did not understand what was wrong. And I had just changed my name um, the day before to from my, you know, my first and last name to Laura the Bargain Hunter because that was when I decided I wanted to start doing videos, but I hadn't recorded anything yet. And so I thought maybe it had something to do with that, that my settings didn't follow me over. And so I was confused. Um, and I reached out to Kim who showed me, you know, what I did wrong and how to fix it and everything was fine. But Nancy being the sweetheart that she is, um, I guess she thought I was upset with her and I really wasn't. I was more sad because I was like, yeah, I won. Oh, I didn't win. Oh, well. You know, and I, I literally was just like, oh, I'll fix it. And maybe next time I'll win something. You know, I really wasn't upset with her at all because she didn't do anything wrong. But she felt so bad that she reached out to me and still wanted to send me something. And I thought about saying no, but I didn't want to, you know, I'm one of those people, I overthink things. And I'm like, well, if I say no, then I don't want her to think that I'm not grateful that she reached out and oh, it was a whole thing. So I was like, well, that would be lovely, you know, if, if she has something she wants to send me. Yes. So I gave her my address and I got it a few days ago and I just haven't had time to film much lately. So I wanted to shout her out before I get into showing my haul. So it came in a, a, a little box and it was wrapped up in this beautiful tissue. I love this color and the little, little stars on there. And she has, she's got her ish together. She's got little cards their picture on it. Thank you for your support and a little QR code and it takes you like right to her page. She is, I strive to be like that. Um, she's really got her stuff together. It's beautiful too. The card is just gorgeous. So the inside was this Anastasia palette of um, highlighters. Moonchild Glow Kit it's called. Hopefully this will show up on camera. Can't really do the hand thing because it's bigger than my hand. You can kind of see it. And these colors, you guys, are beautiful. They're so gorgeous. And because they're highlighters, you know, they don't go on that concentrated. So I actually have the purple horseshoe on right now. You all see it right here? Look at that. Isn't that crazy? It's so pretty. So Nancy, thank you, sweetheart. I mean, you are just an absolute doll. I love watching your videos. Her Something about her voice and her demeanor, it's like, it's like drinking chamomile, chamomile tea or something. It's so soothing and relaxing and I just, I love her to death and thank you so much. It, it almost is too much, but I understand with all the craziness and I wasn't trying to, anyone that knows me knows I wasn't trying to like pull one over on anybody. I literally didn't know any better. My settings are all fixed now. Everything's good. Um, and, and she and I have traded a few emails back and forth and I just wanted to make sure I publicly thanked her and showed everyone what she sent me because she's so sweet and it's gorgeous and I love it. So, on to my small haul. That's kind of hard to say. Um, so first I went to the St. Vincent de Paul thrift store locally here um, a few days ago and got a couple of miscellaneous things. Sorry about the bag crinkling. So I got just some stickers for gift bags. 50 cents 
or gifts, I shouldn't say gift bags necessarily, but there's a hundred of them in here. It was only 50 cents. I couldn't say no to that. It's not what I went there for. I really went to look for clothes. And then I got some tissue for wrapping gifts also. And I believe, oh, it's right here. 98 cents. I mean, how can you not, right? You can never have too much tissue. My receipt, because I'm gonna need that in a minute. So one of these items rang up half off. And then I got a cute gray sweater. And it's from The Loft, which love. And I love the kind of exposed seams on it. I thought that would just be really cute with like skinny jeans and like some boots. And it's not super long, you know, it's probably just a little below the waist. Um, so it's not like tunic length or anything. And I think this sweater was $4.07. One of them, because I got two sweaters, one of them was $2.03, one of them was half off. So I'm not sure which one. So that's one of them. Probably doesn't really matter. I mean, they just, I think when you buy two, one of them rings up half off. So this is the other one that I got. And this one is from Maurice's. So, you know, just a, a cute little shop, not like super high end or anything, but it's very long. It's a sweater dress. I don't feel like standing up. I'm trying to show it to you guys. And it has like a nice cowl neck. And it's like a, a heathered purple, which I love, love, love. So yeah, this one was 407, but one of them rang up half off because it was 203. I mean, how cute will that be with leggings and tall boots? And purple is like my favorite color. So I'm super excited about that. So that's what I got at St. Finney. So just a couple of things. So I didn't want to do a haul video for like four things. So I went to Goodwill a couple days later and I got more stuff. So I got, and this is all clothes, um, an Ann Taylor black, uh, sweater, a lightweight sweater with that, like the ballet, I think they call it, like a ballet neck where it's sort of like a wrap. And I don't know if the color shows on here, but it's, it's blue, like a light blue. And I will obviously wear that with a cami under it. Otherwise you show everybody all your business. But I just think that'll be so pretty. I still have to try all these on. Um, at St. Vinny's you can return or exchange at Goodwill. All sales are final and their dressing rooms are closed because of COVID. So they don't fit, I'll just donate them. I don't care. Um, oh, and that sweater was $6.99. And then I got the same sweater in red. You know, holidays. And I just thought this red is so pretty. It's a real true red. A um, little bit of a blue red, but I like the way that looks on my, because I'm so fair skinned. And these brighter colors, I think, are very flattering when you're fair skinned. So I'm excited. Hopefully they fit. And then, I'm just gonna look for my receipt because one of those also rang up half off and I don't know why. Um, those are both $6.99. I think it's this next one. One of them had an orange, yep, yeah, had an orange sticker. It was this one. And this was the one that was half off. So it was $5.99, it was like $3. And it's just color works. I don't think it has anything special. Um, but what I liked about it, it's just a gray sweater. I have a gray thing. Did you notice? I've already showed you two gray sweaters. Um, but it has this little like buckle detail here. If you can see that. I'll close it. So it's kind of like an, you know, an open cardigan. But then it has that little buckle detail. And I just think that's so cute. Again, with boots. I don't know. I think that's going to be adorable. And all of these are, um, well, especially the red one is kind of pilly, but I have a, a sweater 
shaver thing. I'm not scared to wash this and clean this stuff up and make it look nice. Um, I don't have to have brand new stuff. So, anyway, I just thought that was pretty, especially considering it was half off. And I'll probably, knowing me, probably just wear a black, like, t-shirt under it. But you could wear all kinds of different colors to make that pop. It's a very dark charcoal gray. So it is darker than that other sweater that I got. So that's how I justify that they're different. Um, and then the last thing that I got at Goodwill was a pair of jeans. These were $6.99. And they are, I don't care if you guys see my size, not your daughter's jeans. I mean, these jeans are like $80, $100 at Nordstrom. Um, and they're really dark wash, which I love. They have tons of stretch. They're super comfortable. I've had a pair of these before because um, they carry plus sizes. And back when I was plus size, I had a pair that I got at like Nordstrom Rack. And they're, um, these are not skinny jeans, which yay, I have so many pairs of skinny jeans. It's not even funny. These are just a nice straight leg. Let's see. And I'm excited about these. I did not try these on yet either. I haven't I actually just bought the Goodwill stuff today and I got the stuff from Zay Vinny's like two days ago. So I haven't tried any of this on yet. So hopefully they all fit. Um, I'm not gonna do try on videos, maybe someday. Um, Cause I'm still figuring out how to pause. <laughs> My phone is an iPhone. It does not have a pause button on it. It has record on and off. So I could stop the recording and start back up and put the videos together but I don't know how to do that yet either so but anyway I just want to show everything that I got I've got some really cute stuff at Goodwill I spent a total of $26 and I did the roundup thing they you know they have you round up for charity and at St. Vinny's I spent $10 but I also bought some popcorn which is not pictured here because it's already in my belly um they have a big bag it's like it says on here but it's like it's a two foot bag big plastic bag like this full of popcorn and they have different flavors I just get the butter popcorn and I ate it over the course of like two days and this second day when I was finishing it my husband's like well thanks for saving me some popcorn I said you're welcome <laughs> not my fault you didn't eat any I mean I, he was sitting there watching me eat it I'm like I don't know what to tell you popcorn is my nemesis I love it um, that's why I work out so I can eat stuff like popcorn and not feel guilty. I don't even think I would feel guilty even if I didn't work out, to be honest. I love popcorn that much, but. Oh, there was one more thing I wanted to show you guys real quick. So when I went to both of those stores, I was looking for a black tunic top or sweater, kind of like that purple one that I showed you. That was literally all I was going to buy and I bought all this other stuff. So I finally gave up. I went to Ross, I went to TJ Maxx, I went to Marshalls, couldn't find anything. Actually, after going to a second Marshalls, I finally found a black one. So I bought it um, today. I'm hoping still to find a cheaper one before I wear this so that I can return it. <laughs> because this was $25 and I don't know. It's funny, I'll spend that at Kohl's without batting an eyelash, but when I go to like Ross or TJ Maxx or any of those kind of stores and marshals, I want the bargains. Um, like what, I mean, not as cheap as when I get a Goodwill, but I just want a good deal. So supposedly the compare price is $32, but it is actually really pretty. It's It's got a, like a big turtleneck. It's not really even a cowl neck because it doesn't hang down that low, but it's more of a sweater dress because I have a lot of different colored leggings. So I wanted a, just a solid black one. So Anyway, we will see if I keep that. Thanks so much for watching, everybody. Hope you enjoyed this. Um, please like and subscribe my videos. I will be doing another one soon with some Dollar Tree stuff. And then I've got a few other things coming um, that I ordered online coming next week. So thank you so much. Um, stay safe. And just thanks for the support. I really appreciate it. Bye-bye.